Então, alguma última palavra de sabedoria? Afinal, você já derrotou eles. Bom, mais ou menos. Cala essa boca, Luiz. Aconteça o que acontecer. Ah, 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 não! Merda! Caralho! Merda! Se esconde! Vai! Omar, eu cuido dele. Se esconde, Jay! Bem, só não se mexe nem faz barulho. Que porra é essa? Se concentra. São só espantalhos. Parece que levaram a gente a sério. Espalhem-se. Você não vai ter a chance. Cadê os nossos recrutas? Eles não são seus! Vasculhem o pátio. Se a Clementine se mexer, atirem. A gente vai achar eles, Clementine. E a gente vai levar eles. E você. E o seu menininho. Talvez seja melhor não andarem muito por aí. Vocês podem ativar uma armadilha. Você tá blefando. É só dar mais um passo pra descobrir. Ou então vaza, porra. Não sabe ler? Você mudou. Eu cresci. Tô vendo. Meu Deus, você é igual a ele. O Lee ficaria decepcionado de saber que te ensinou todas as coisas erradas. Que a garotinha fofa que ele protegeu virou essa coisa. Não. Nem toca no nome dele. Eu conheci ele melhor do que... Jamais! Sai daqui! Se você não me ajudar a encontrar os outros, aposto que eu arrumo outro voluntário. A gente já recrutou pessoas dessa escola. A Minnie queria ter vindo hoje, pra te contar como ela se adaptou bem à nossa vida. Como ela tá feliz. Ela disse que tinha uma namorada aqui. Amigos que fazem falta pra ela. Tipo um cara que sempre fazia ela rir toda hora. E o irmãozinho dela. Ela sente mais a falta dele. Merda! Cadê elas? Deixa eu te levar até elas. Não posso. Só quero elas de volta. Por favor. Você vai ficar mais feliz lá com elas. Elas estão com saudade. Não acredita, Ter. Você sabe que ela tá mentindo. Ela sequestrou suas irmãs, tirou elas de você, da casa delas. Merda! 
A gente vai ter uma conversinha. Eu e você. Só nós dois. Ah! Sua escrota! Clem, não, não consigo. Pra trás! Sabe sempre que eu vejo uma pessoa como você? Fraca, pequena, medrosa e ainda viva. Bom, aposto que um monte de gente morreu para você chegar aqui.
Merda, não devia ser difícil. Você não vai me matar. Eu sei que não vai. Sabe como? A gente era uma família. Você não vai machucar ninguém da sua família.
Clem, me desculpa por confiar nela. Eles levaram o Assim e o Omar e o Luz, porra. Eu sei. A gente vai atrás deles. Se a gente soubesse onde procurar, eu mesma derrubava os muros deles. Mas a gente não sabe. Bom, a gente tá com alguém que sabe.
Previously on The Walking Dead. While searching for a place to call home, AJ and I found an old boarding school run by kids deep in the forest. Their leader was a guy named Marlin. And AJ pulled the trigger. I told AJ that what he'd done was murder, that he'd have to atone for it. The other kids agreed. They voted to kick us out. I thought we'd never return. Then, AJ and I were attacked by Abel, one of the raiders Marlin had given the twins to. He was with someone I thought I'd never see again. Lily. We were almost eaten by walkers when suddenly one of them spoke to me. His name was James, an ex-whisperer who didn't believe in killing walkers. He helped me treat AJ, but without real medicine, he wouldn't make it. The kids didn't turn away the sad sight of AJ and let us back inside. After I told them how we could defend the school against the raiders, they were willing to let us stay, at least until the fight. I decided to help Violet in the bell tower. We looked at the stars together, and I admitted I had feelings for her. She felt the same way. Then the raiders finally came. They busted open our gates, but the kids stayed hidden as planned. Until Ten ran out of cover, hoping for a chance to learn about his missing sisters. The bomb went off, and attempting to save Ten, Mitch threw himself at Lily and got a knife to the throat. With only a second to decide, I fired and saved Violet. They got away with three of our friends, and we had no idea where they'd gone. But we knew someone who did. the start, I was so little, and, and Mitch looked after me. People said he was a dick sometimes, but he was always nice to me. Now he's gone. Stabbed in the eye by some asshole who never even knew his name. Mitch was looking after all of us. He gave his life so we could go on fighting. I know that. Doesn't make it any easier. He'd want us to find our friends and bring them home safe. And he'd want us to kill the people who took them. Hey, AJ's waiting for you in the basement. We got Abel tied up tight. He's alive, but he's out cold. Thanks. We should bury Mitch. It's time. I'll help you carry Get away from him! <laughs> You're the reason he's dead! Willie! Well, it's true! We had a plan, and that idiot messed it up! Come on, Willie. None of this is Ten's fault. 
You know who's really to blame. I can't believe you're defending him! This... This is bullshit! Ten! I'll take care of this. Talk to Abel, find out where Lily took Lewis, Omar, and Asim. And Clem, don't be afraid to, you know, hurt him a little. Maybe you'll get more out of him than we did. Should be strong enough to hold him. Got your gun back, huh? Uh-huh. <sighs> Ready? his afternoon nap. I was having a nice dream, too. About a girl I used to know from before. She also had me tied up, but I wasn't her prisoner if you get my meaning. <laughs> you got any water? Other than what you already dumped on me? I mean... Drink. A good man or squirt? Don't mind if I do. <laughs> You've had your water. Now it's time to talk. It's the first time interrogating someone, isn't it? <laughs> you let me dictate the agenda. Makes me think you're weak. Don't make this harder than it needs to be, okay? I just want to know where Lily took my people. It doesn't matter. As soon as she gets there, she's gonna turn around and come right back for me. <laughs> you better give me the five-star treatment. If I'm smiling when she gets here, you might be able to trade me for a little mercy. We underestimated you little shits, but Lily won't make the same mistake twice.
You aren't gonna do that. You don't have it in you. Just tell us where they took our friends so we can get them back. <laughs> Lily will never give them up. The only reason we came here was for more manpower. Losing Jonathan and me for three sprouts that can barely hold a gun. Even a dummy like me can do the math on that one. We're gonna get him back. You don't know what it's like out there. It's a bloodbath. One community against another. From Richmond to the coast. Back at the Delta, we're at war. With some really sick fucks who make me look like the Virgin Mary. We need people to fight it. Soldiers who do what we say. Point the guns the way we tell them to. You little turds are supposed to be easy pickings. That's called kidnapping. Give it whatever name you want. I call it survival. What kind of place is this Delta if they use forced labor to defend it? You think we like doing raids like this? Our home is under threat. It's a good home. Built to last. I'd do a lot to protect it. Maybe you can understand that. And i do a lot to get my friends back. So stop wasting my time. Okay. Front pocket. The answer to all your questions. Read it. Whatsoever parteth the hoof, and is cloven-footed, and cheweth the cud, among the beasts, that shall ye eat? What the fuck? Is this code? No, it's fucking Leviticus. I was hoping it'd be some timely, moralistic shit about turning the other cheek. Well, come on. That thing ain't gonna light itself. Wanna know where your friends are? Smoke will clear my mind. Help me remember stuff. Like where Lily went. Now that is heavenly. <coughs> <coughs> That's a lot of blood. Oh, fuck. This is not good. He's gonna die, isn't he? I hope so. And I hope he suffers every moment till he does. You're gonna get your wish. When you pushed me off that balcony, something must have burst inside of me. Shit. I never wanted things to end like this. Everything. It all got out of hand. Now look at me. I'm a fucking mess. Will he turn? No! <laughs> My, my whole life, everything I ever got, I got with my own two hands and my will for my body to dirt on me, to take control. I'll tell you where to find Lily. Just promise you won't let me turn. I'm begging you. How about this? How about you tell me everything you know, and then we'll see. I need assurances. That's as good as you're gonna get. Hurry up, Abel. You don't have much time. You wouldn't do it. You wouldn't let me become one of those things. Try me. What if they... What if they could feel it? when they turn. 
You'll find out soon enough. Maybe you just end up trapped, along for the ride. There are people trapped inside walkers? Yeah, yeah. That's why you put a bullet in them, if they're gonna turn. Or maybe that's why you let them. Okay, okay. <coughs> in my boot, you'll find a paper with everything you need to know. AJ, check his boot. We have a boat. <laughs> that paper shows the miles to the nearest stops. Those words, their city names. We use them like a call and response. Make sure we don't go shooting our own. Only one we use these days is Rockingham. I can't believe you actually got me to give that up. You... you got what you wanted? Please... Don't let me become one of those things. Please... I don't want to turn. Not that. I wanna... let me keep my face. You don't need to watch this. I want to. At least you can't hurt anyone anymore. Yeah. Come on, we have a boat to find. Once we find the boat, we'll look for a way to sneak on board. Yeah, if Ten doesn't fuck it up this time. It wasn't Ten's fault. Yes, it was! Mitch died because he- Say one more thing about Ten. I dare you. Guys, look!
You see anything? The beach, um, a boat, and a, a wood street in the water. That's called a pier. Hmm. Pier. Okay, let's spread out and focus on those areas. Keep your heads low. Find anything over here? They have horses. Let me see. Are those torches? I think so. Could be easy fire. Setting the hay on fire would get their attention. Scare the horses too. We could get on the boat easier that way. If we cut those horses free, we could slow down anyone trying to chase us. Anything useful? Looks like building material. Furniture. Probably stuff from the train station. Sheet metal, wood, and... Quite a bit of it. We should have that stuff. More torches. Torches? We could use the fire. Oh, yeah. those rafts with supplies. I could cut those loose and just ride them down river. Easy! You ever seen this boat before? No. Marlin kept us confined to the safe zone. Pier leading up to the boat? It's our only way in and out. Well, let's see what else is down there. There are a few on deck. A couple others on the pier. Could be more inside. Looks like they're well-armed, too. Wait, I see Lewis. Abel wasn't lying. This is it. I don't see any obvious place to keep prisoners. They're probably below deck. We should have asked Abel. When he said on a boat, I didn't think it'd be this big. The pier has plenty of cover on it. If we're careful, we can sneak in undetected. There's 
There's no good cover leading up to the boat. We're gonna need one hell of a distraction. Walkers! Maybe if we could get walkers on the beach somehow. Maybe not as hard as you'd think. see an entrance. I saw that too. It looks like there's a door at the other end. There's a small opening at the top of those closed doorways. AJ and I know how to deal with those. We should get out of here before they spot us. We can talk through the plan once we're somewhere safe. Plan. Well, they've got guards posted on the pier and the boat. There's no way we can take them all at once. Our only hope is to distract them while we sneak on board. We should burn their stuff. That'd work. We could burn the supplies or the hay they keep for the horses. Whatever we don't burn, we should take. Ruby would love to have the horses. But I'd rather steal those supplies. Yeah, we'll steal their supplies and burn the hay as our distraction. If you're going to steal from the rafts, you have to do it carefully. Wouldn't do it any other way. The fire will lure the raiders away from the boat, and we can sneak across the pier. If anyone sees us, they'll shoot! You remember that guy I told you about? James? He sent in walkers to save us from Lily and Abel. Maybe we could convince him to do it again. If we lead a big enough group of them onto the beach, we can blend in without being seen. Perfect. What about after we get everyone home? I mean, the raiders will just come attack us again. What then? Hide, quick! A raider. Has to be. You all stay here. I'll see if they know anything that could help us. Drop it! Are there? 